Tipper, she is the coolest frog in the entire pond, I'm telling you. Plus, she's beautiful. <laughs> we created Hipper and Hopper, two totally awesome frogs, as a bright, fun piece that would educate viewers about frogs and how we can help them in terms of conservation. It has been so successful for us that we want to give other places the opportunity to enjoy and utilize this short theater piece. They're not? No, they're not. There are red frogs. Really? Red frogs? And blue frogs. And blue frogs? And yellow frogs. Wow, yellow frogs. And then, of course, there are very large frogs, <laughs> like the Goliath that lives in Africa. He's large enough to eat small birds and mice. Wow. The largest frog that lives in North America is the bullfrog. Hey, I know him. Is that a fly? Do you see? But there's you a should, fly? You should. Where's the fly? Hi, Hopper. Hi, call me. <laughs> oh, no, I get the door. It's closing. I get. No, I'm hitting the button. Oh, we're still hitting the close. button. Don't. <laughs> so cold blooded. Hey, I know that song. Home, home on the range. Where the frogs and the tadpoles play. <laughs> we learned about frogs in the environment and how frogs can tell really bad jokes. They are different from toads. I do like frogs. Do you like Hipper and Hopper? They are the best frogs ever. Frogs and toads are getting sick. Getting sick? Yes, and they're disappearing. Disappearing? Yes, they're disappearing. And toads too? And toads too. Two. Well, if two toads have disappeared, I think we better go out and look for them. Mother, I'm afraid that it's more than two toads, like our distant cousins, the golden toads of Costa Rica. Oh, yeah. I think I remember them. Pretty, very pretty, dark yellow toads. Right. So, Hipper, if yes, things that are bad for the environment are bad for frogs, too, then that means that things that are good for a healthy environment are good for frogs as well. Uh, so how about it? Are you guys willing to hop on board to help out your frog friends? I think I love you.